Hello everybody and Robert. Uh, how are you all? You well? Yes, I'm wearing a, a towel turban. I've not long been out of the shower. Yeah, I'm aware of it. Uh, you know when you think it's going to go and then it doesn't and, and so. But yeah, we're in fresh pyjamas today. Towel gown. It's all very good. My hands are a little bit rough. So, how are you? You well? You doing good? Good. <coughs> Sorry, I've just had a Snickers. So I do have a little bit of peanut butter and peanuts in my um I'm trying to get rid of so if I look distracted then that's why that's better my hands are yeah post shower you can get a little bit dried out but anyway um we shall start today with Do -do -do. a little reindeer he's a cutie the big red nose got a scarf um, the arms are a bit fun because you kind of just sort of have to wedge them into the foamy and then the string is actually wrapped all around his body with a, it's not a reef knot is it? It's a, it's a special type of knot that I've known for years that is good for going around, you know, so you can, if you've got a pole or something you're trying to attach to, it's like a double loop knot. Uh, let's see if I can show you. Nope, not enough string there. I can't, I don't have any string to hand okay yes i do right it's, it's it's attached to there we go so you you loop one and then you loop another behind it and then you put the one behind the other and then you've got your your rod or your post or whatever and it actually goes on quite firm and then you can carry on tying on from that so that's the little that's the knot i use to um make my reindeer and then if you need to, it does just come away. And then uh, you've got it done up. Well, I will untangle that later. Yeah. Preferably without dropping my um unfinished kit. But speaking of crafty type things, we'll start with this one today because obviously we're on the alternate day. So we want number two on this one, which is down here. Again, I'm going to try nice and gentle so I don't rip the picture. And, uh, yeah. So I'm going to try and keep this one a little bit quicker because I am supposed to be going online with a friend and we're going to watch a film together. So, you know. But I wanted to get this out of the way. And then because after the film I'll probably be making dinner and it's the whole thing. So, uh, we have, I believe, that's a little wet. No instructions here, but I guess I can work it out from how the squirrel went together. So uh, let's see if I can make it a bit quicker this time. So yeah, um, so I I, I gave um, Robert a quick shout out because he has been. Um, so I'm I'm presuming you're a he. Um, they've uh, they've been um commenting on all my videos and saying how much they've enjoyed them. And thank you, I do appreciate that. But you know, if you want me to give you a little shout out and say, hey, this person. Then you know the comment section is there. I will, I will come and say hello, and you know, then I can be talking to you, and not just you know other people. So yeah, that's that's a thing that I like to do. If I see, if I do see people like I do have some people that do like to comment um, every now and again. I do recognise your name. I'm not always good at necessarily answering or wouldn't necessarily always shout you out. But I do see you. I do notice you, and it does, you know. I like to think we may be building up a bit of a community. You don't really talk to each other, but if you can, if you want to. But I like to, at some point, maybe we can build up a bit of a community. Just like I'm building up this little rabbit. And, can we get a bit quicker? Yay, there we go. So that goes there. Press the legs. Press the legs. And the face does look a bit weird. If I pull it up again, you can you can see that the face is kind of there. But then when you put it onto the base. Because there's nothing actually on the side. So I might draw a little nose or something on there. So the face is a little bit odd. But the rest of it, you can see like the overall shape. He's very cute. He's a very cute little bunman. So there you go. Pop that up there with the squirrel. They can hang out. Wow, it's a big bun bun. Very big. And... Since it's the one in the front, we'll go for the next the next friend's thing. I did manage to get the pizza pin off. Um, 
If you found me this one first yesterday. Yeah, I think I oh, you know what? It's the one in my hand. Excuse me. <coughs> like I said, just eaten. Yes. Actually it does say that on their accessories that don't count But that one says official. Oh well. Um so where are we? Oh we're on Yeah, three four. Day four up here. It's got a bit of width to it, so maybe it's a scrunchie. Uh, maybe it's something else. Uh, we'll have a look. Because, like I said, I'm trying not to. Uh, this isn't necessarily the best box. I keep ripping up the um, ones next to it. So, give me a second to put it down. Uh, I am having fun. There is like um, a charm bracelet one that I was gonna think about getting. Oh! Um, but I didn't really have the. The thing for it. Give me a second. I need to get my knife out. So, blue. <sighs> need to concentrate because it's it's wedged in here quite well. Um, yeah. No, I saw it online. And I probably could have got it for a reasonable price, but one, I didn't want to make the whole thing, you know, just about friends, which I could, I absolutely could, and maybe next year when I haven't got because the back to future one's quite expensive. Um, but yeah, it was, it was, um, uh, not a prime one, so it would have had the, um, excuse me, it would have been that extra shipping and it wasn't even that expensive, but I don't know. I was just like, eh, I'll get it next time. So, but today we do, speaking of charm bracelets, uh, oh, it's kind of a little bit bunchy. The threads are going to be a bit fuzzy. So I'll have to adjust it and play with it a little. But if I pull it all together, because I can't get the um, I can't get this charm. Oh, it's all fluffy unless. Oh, hang on. If I stretch it, hey, look at that. So it's a bit more evened out now. But you can see, it says smile, and there's a pizza. There's a pe. There's a. There's a pizza. Which is the pin and a little heart, and it is like I said, you you saw it's quite stretchy still. Yeah, no, that goes on. That's quite comfy. It's not too. I'm not usually a big fan of bracelets or wearing stuff like that, but um, it, it it's not irritating. It's, it's quite light, so yeah, very cute. A smile. Nextly, we have a rattly distraction noisy fidgety box. Or, you know, just fidget to all oh, your advent calendar. Whatever you want to call it. Yeah, day four. Day four, day four, day four. Where you at? There we go. Ooh, it's, um, you can't really tell, but it's quite a longer shape. So, definitely not a little fuzzy ball, which it shouldn't be. There we go. Use my, the long nail to, ooh, poke. Ooh, something's hard behind there. I'm not making the jokes. Okay, there's... I have a small issue. There's like two things kind of poking through. I think that goes to there. So there's ooh. Um. So I think I mentioned before I've been watching Nerdy Crafter, and she has been opening some fidget calendar advent stuff, and she had like two of these in hers, but it's like a a long, smooth, stringy, stretchy. Wow, that's that's super stretchy, and it, it's neon, and you can. Oh, it's a big stretchy gummy, and uh, let's see. Oh, that's got a lot of give. I'm gonna let it go because I think it's gonna have to. Yeah, there's quite a lot of snap back in that as well. Um, or oh, I could, yeah, you could just see sort of just playing with that and chilling with it, or you know, tying it up around. That's really bright as well. Don't know if I've got enough juice in here, but it's gonna. Oh yeah, uh, I don't know if you can see that. But it also goes quite well under the uh, the UV, so you could wear it when you're clubbing. <laughs> but yeah, no, this this has flown off over there. Um, but yeah, I was watching Nerdy Crafter yesterday, and she opened up. She had a, a pair of them in her one. I was like, "Ooh, that looks like fun." Um, I'll have to see if um, I wonder if I'll get one of those, and I did. So uh, yeah, that's not annoying, is it? I think the ones she'd have were slightly better quality, but you know what? 
it does. It's fun. I can see me playing with this for hours. <sighs> cool. Right, next up we have the official Friends Advent Calendar. Uh, really, again, I don't know what's the difference because they're both WB. They're both by the company. Anyway, so let me have a look. I think I don't know, it's a Monday. Oh yeah, day four. But I didn't get to shake my belly like a dope bowl full of. I didn't get to shake my belly like a bowl full of jelly. Time to quote again with the um the toy key, which is actually a Thanksgiving Day toy key, and not um not Christmas. But we'll still excuse me. Ooh. Ooh. It's a long, another long skinny one, I think. Oh, yay! I like bookmarks. I like bookmarks. Is it just the one? Yeah. I, I, I do collect bookmarks. I have a lot of fun with those. So let me pop this down and we'll have a closer look. So we've got a blue side and a purple side. So on the purple we've got the chicken duck and the cup and a design so the, the ones that are distinct we've got a key we've got chicken dart and we've got the cup oh and we've got the um monica's frame just on the edge there and the other side or oh, we have the frame chicken duck key friends written out and again the christmas thanksgiving twiggy that's cute and you can see it comes with a little ribbon which actually realized something um <laughs> Now, obviously, this is an advent calendar, so you're opening it up as you go along, but this also has a string. Are you supposed to put these on the tree? <laughs> obviously, the bookmark isn't going to go in this, so I'll just pop it to one side safely. Um, but, uh, yeah, this is really cute. This is cute. Pop that away. And lastly, but never leastly, I don't know if leastly is a word, but I'm going with it. We have the Max 3 calendar, very rattly, and numero 4, where are you? Quattro. Uh, sorry, it's, it's, there. it's there. And that one popped open really smoothly. Ooh, a little bit dark, a little bit... Yeah. A little, little bit grim, but we have, to finish off our um, mine slash graveyard set, we have something that's on the floor. You know it's one of my videos when things get dropped, so we're doing all right. We have Emmett's, um, here lies Emmett Brown died September 7th, 1885. And then, um, I'm assuming, I can't read this properly, but I'm assuming it's, you know, saying about, um, shot by Mad, Mad Don Cannon over the matter of $80. Um, so resurrected in, in memory by, um, his beloved Clara. Now, this is very cool. Now, if you remember the um, mall sign we got last year, on the one side it was Twin Pines, on the other side it was Lone Pine. This hasn't got the Here Lies Clint Eastwood, but they never did a, the Clint Eastwood side, but they could have done like the Here Lines and the Date and the, um, the Stone. So they could have done it with just the um, the basic information. But yeah, we've got Doc Brown, Gravestone, a little bit grim. But to be fair, I was expecting it. I'm trying to avoid the spoilers off of this box because they are everywhere if you look carefully, but I'm trying not to because I'm trying to keep myself as fresh as possible for the box. So, and you can see it's it's quite a good size. It's a good good plastic hollow inside, obviously, but uh, yeah, no, it's it's quite solid. So, uh, yeah, no, this is this is a fun haul. This is, um, oh, well, this isn't fun. Um, it's a bit depressing, but we know it ends so well. If, if you haven't seen Back to the Future 3, uh, it ends well. <laughs> and also, go watch it. It's amazing. Well, watch the whole, watch all of them, but then we watch three. Um, so, there we go. Poor old Copernicus, you can keep watch. Uh, so, yeah. That's today. Um, we had some fun things. Uh, uh, this is cute. Bookmark's always fun. I got, a, I got a stretchy thing that I'll be probably playing with for ages. And I need to untie my my thread. So not a bad day overall. Anyway, I am going to finish this video. And I'll upload it. And then you can watch and watch it. So hello! How how is however long later? How how are we doing? Are we still alive? We're good?
The world's still here. Excellent. But anyway, we are definitely in the waffle mode now, so I am going to sign off and say, if you have been, thanks for watching, especially you are still here, you are the awesome people. I'm Michelle, you've been watching, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye!